Does that look fresh to death again? Yep. Thanks. Beautiful. Of course he does. Hey, this is Jay Fluid out here for Phillies Nation TV. I'm at First Energy Stadium talking with Kyle Simon. And Kyle, you were acquired last year in a, in a pretty well-reported, well-touted well deal uh, from Baltimore for uh, a guy that's going to be a future Hall of Famer, Jim Tomey. You know, when, when, that, when that news comes your way, what's that like? And, you know, how, what's the feeling being traded for a guy of his stature? Um, it's great. I mean, I just want to live up to uh, what they traded me for. So uh, <clears throat> hopefully I'll do my best and uh, enter the realm of I mean, I don't even know. I just want, I just want to do as good as that guy and uh, put the effect that he had because he is a great great player and great person, too. So let's have that in the Phillies organization, too. Absolutely. Now, you acquired from Baltimore in that deal last June. Uh, you know, were there any big differences between the two organizations that you noticed? Um, yeah, the Phillies are – I just enjoy the Phillies a lot more. It's more of a family-based. Um, everyone's got your back, and they are just uh, – great organization to be with. I mean, just everything from the lowest to the top are all uh, professional, and it's, it's just great to be in this organization. You have to come here and join this double-A roster in Reading last year and be part of a, a big playoff push. You're really a uh, considerable contributor to that team. Uh, what was that like for you to be re you know really come in here and be a big part of that? It was great. I mean, I, I love to pitch under pressure, and we did that a lot um, in that playoff push. So um, anything you put me in, I'm going to do my best to get outs and uh, dominate so uh, it was just a great experience and um, it's tough that we lost but uh, we had a great team and uh, a lot of those guys are going to be on the big league club in the next few years. And speaking of that now you, you kind of uh, kind of upped your uh, stature on the team this year your status on the team you're, you're the, the, the big guy in the bullpen now you're the closer uh, you know what does that mean to, to kind of have, have that weight on your shoulders or have that that role put upon you? Um, I mean there's not really any difference but I mean it's just kind of <laughs> If you mess up, it's it's going to be viewed a lot more than a guy in the middle innings kind of doing it. But, um, I mean, I enjoy it. Uh, any any spot you put me in, I'm going to do my best. And, uh, and I haven't been doing it so well this uh, this season so far, but that's going to turn around very soon. So I know you got experience last fall in the Arizona Fall League out there. Uh, you know, what was that experience like for you, and, and, and was it beneficial to you to be playing with your manager and with your teammates out there? Yeah, it was great. Um, great experience, great players. I mean, I think already about six or seven of them on our team that we won it with uh, already got called up. So we just had a phenomenal team, and the players are just the uh, best in the nation. So, I mean, it was a good experience. And one last thing for you before I let you go, and thanks so much for your time. I know uh, you were pretty pretty well touted for your signature look last year when you joined the organization. It's kind of gone away. It looks like it's coming back. Yeah. Uh, just talk about that a little bit. Uh, I shaved it because I was kind of having a rough patch, but uh, – He'll be back and uh, give me about a week and a half, and I'll have it back. Don't worry about that. And so. Of course, that's the hot mustache we were talking about. Uh, I'm Jay Floyd. That's Kyle Simon. Back to you guys with Phillies Nation TV. Kyle, thanks so Alrighty. much. Silly questions, like 90 more seconds.